What's up guys and welcome back to the life of Kevin. Barbie has just finished explaining to Kevin everything that she found out last episode. Kevin now knows of the alien invasion. Barbie found out that her mother is apparently now the queen of the aliens. So she is going to be the one who is going to be leading the charge and the only way to stop this invasion is for Kevin to assassinate the queen. So to return to the alien homeworld and destroy the alien queen, Kevin is going to have to be well equipped. Barbie does have a sim ray from her job, so I think we're going to get her to kind of um, just upgrade that a little bit, get that ready to go, and then we'll equip him with that. While she's working on that, Kevin is going to get dressed for the deed, and then we're going to send him up. The rocket ship is ready, Barbie's already prepared it, it now has the, um, the wormhole generator required so we don't need a portal, and then Kevin's going to try to make his way back to the alien world. So Barbie's preparing. I actually don't know if you can hand a sim ray to another sim. I hope you can. You don't have to be a scientist to use it. Here's Kevin now. Kevin, what the hell are you wearing? I said you're gonna go assassinate an alien queen and not discover their existence. What What do you have on? Why does this exist in the game? He's got like a flashlight taped to his arm? And no, 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 Kevin, get back here. I'm not done judging your wardrobe yet. He's got a router taped to the back of his head. <laughs> and another flashlight taped to his head. How is this inconspicuous? How are you going to assassinate a queen inconspicuously like this? You can't fight all of them. Okay, you need to change into something better. All right, Kevin, come show us your next option. <laughs> okay. I said inconspicuous because you are going to assassinate a queen. I didn't really think ninja. That's uh, that's a little further than I took it, but it's an improvement. Yeah, that's it. That's an improvement, right? What else you got? And attempt number three brings... Okay, a bit of a James Bond look. You're still missing shoes, Kevin. I know James Bond wore shoes. Again, I don't really know if that's going to be super appropriate. I feel like you're going to stand out. So, if that's all you have, if that's your three options, we get to choose between Paranoid Alien Investigator, Ninja, or James Bond. I think I'm going to go with Ninja. Now, come say your goodbyes, Kevin, because we don't know how strong these aliens are going to be. Maybe they'll be tougher than we think. You know, you always underestimate the Sims, but they could be tougher than you think. Kevin's tougher than you think. So, Kevin does now have the Sim Ray. That should work well, but that's not lethal, as I'm sure you guys know. The Simray just freezes people solid, and it doesn't kill them. We need a little bit more of a lethal option if we're going to stop this invasion. And Barbie has found out in her research that the aliens are incredibly sensitive to electricity. So Kevin has ringed up one of those joke buzzers. You know, you would shake somebody's hand, uh, you would get a buzz, a little electrical shock, everybody would laugh. That should now be lethal for aliens. So we should be able to kill the queen by making a joke. But with that being said, Kevin, it's time to go. Travel through the wormhole. The whole the whole world, your whole family is relying on you, Kevin. That's why Kevin chose to do this. You guys know Kevin isn't a killer. He's a soft-hearted guy. He wouldn't just go kill somebody if he didn't have to. But this is the whole world at stake here. This is an evil alien. This has to be done. So, one small step for man. One giant... <laughs> He has to put on the uh, the astronaut suit over his ninja suit. <laughs> Good luck, Kevin! The ship hurdles through the wormhole and emerges near an alien planet. A series of odd noises comes from the on-ship radio and Kevin is suddenly teleported off his ship. Kevin, your ninja outfit isn't working. They know you're coming. This has already gone terribly. I knew you shouldn't have put on that astronaut costume over the ninja outfit. Now they... No, you're here. Uh, Kevin? The UFO's gone. The UFO's gone, Kevin, and all the aliens are gone. The invasion's already begun. We we need to get back, Kevin. We need to go find them. Uh, return home. Oh, that's that can't be good. Well, if they aren't on Sixum, then where the hell are they? They're not here. They're not in Willow Creek. Shopping district is untouched as always. And oh, is that Kevin? Is that it? I think that's the UFO, Kevin. We need to go. That is definitely the UFO, Kevin. We found it. You're not supposed to be dressed like an astronaut, Kevin. We're supposed to be supposed to be dressed like a ninja. They're gonna see you coming. So they're not outside. They did a good job hiding the UFO. Do we how how are we gonna knock on door? That is not how you sneakily assassinate somebody. 
Kevin, I don't normally do this, but this one time, I'm gonna help you out. This is gonna be your ninja skill ability, because I have a feeling if you just knock on the door and somebody answers and then you run in their guns blazing, things aren't gonna end well. Probably not the best idea, so I'm gonna scout around for you and uh, just let you know what's going on here using my special camera. So, whoop, we're in, and we found an alien, and she's wearing a crown, so I'm gonna guess that's the queen. I'm gonna guess that's Barbie's mother, and that's our target. Okay, you know what, Kevin? I think you can take her. She doesn't look so tough. It is a small UFO, so maybe there's not a whole lot of aliens in here. There's nobody helming the, uh, helming the battle stations here, so that's a good thing. Are you, are you kidding me right now? Will Smith, I knew it! Smug bastard sitting here with your chips. I knew you were in on it all along! What are you sitting here watching? What's up guys, Just and welcome unpause. back to the life of Will Smith. And in this episode, I think we're going to be doing some more alien things, you know, because aliens are pretty much most of the sim world right now. There's what not a whole lot of people hell? left besides Will Smith. So I think oh we're my god, it all makes sense now. So the alien scoping out the house. Abducting Kevin. Following the kids everywhere. Will Smith being at Emma's job all the time. They never wanted to take over the world, they wanted to take over the series! <laughs> Kevin, you need you need to get off your phone, Kevin. They're trying to steal your series. We can't let this happen. There's only two of them, Kevin. I think you can do it. Okay, we can use this first. Prevent abductions. That's a good start. So we're gonna send out a signal, and they're gonna think it's from the Queen. No more aliens will come. Keep the aliens from abducting us. Perfect. So now... Yes, we kind of have to knock on the door. We need to be polite. Damn Sims. Okay, you can do this, Kevin. So, I don't know who we're going to go for first. We'll see uh, We'll see who approaches us. <laughs> Your ninja outfit is so good. Okay, here we go. I think they're split up. Are you, are you knocking? I can't tell. Oh, the, the I can't see anything until you get in. There we go. Okay, we're in. Where's... Where's... Oh, she's asleep. Kevin, this is perfect. We, we can divide and conquer. So, we need you to freeze... Freeze him. Freeze him, Kevin. Try to take over my series, will you, Will Smith? No, no, no. Back to the Fresh Prince with you. That's one down, Kevin. We can... What? What just happened? Is he frozen or not, Kevin? No. Oh, Kevin, she's found out. She's found onto you. We need to kill her. This is for impregnating me. Did it work? She, she's, she seems okay. No, it worked, Kevin. Barbie was right! Oh my god, that was more violent than I had expected. Oh, wow! Way to go, Kevin! You did it! Oh, hey, Death! So, this is awkward. Not only do you seem to see our family a lot when people die, but I didn't think you covered alien deaths. We should probably bring Barbie here. I kind of feel bad. It is technically still her biological mother, even if she was evil. You know, she should get to see... Shit, what is her name? Pollination Technician number three. That's what the three means on her, um, on her crib. It's because she was Senior Pollination Technician number three. Well, there you go. Okay, mystery solved. So, Barbie, you can give, come in. And, uh, we'll just say our goodbyes. Barbie could not give less of a shit. Whoa, watch it, Barbie. You don't want to get cut. Death doesn't mess around. Cool. Look at that! I didn't know they had, like, alien caskets. That's really neat. Now that I think about it, I wonder if you could kill Death. Like, if Kevin used the hand Amazing buzzer, can you freeze Death? That would be interesting. I have a feeling we probably shouldn't, though, because he's kind of important in the balance of things. He does a lot of work for us, but also because it seems like Barbie's kind of into him. You see? Mwah. It's a bit of an interesting relationship there. Who knows? Well, I guess that's all we really have to do here, guys. I mean, everything's pretty much done. Whoa, Kevin, what are you doing? Oh, it's death leaving. I was like, what's that ridiculous noise? What are you doing, Kevin? Is this some kind of alien contraption you're playing? Like, three-dimensional blick block. This is cool. We need to get one of these. Can we take this one? No. Okay, Kevin, we'll buy one when we get home, but I don't think we should be spending too much time in uh, in the alien place. You know what? I'm not going to kill Will Smith. I think we're just going to leave him here. 
This is what you get, Will. You want to try to take over the series? You got your own series, man. You're, you're past your prime, so you get to sit here for all eternity and just think about what you've done. All right, Kevin, it's time to go home. We are leaving. You are raiding their fridge. What are you doing? Oh, you're just going to take a glass of milk with you? <laughs> man, killing is thirsty work. <laughs> so I guess everything uh -huh. is sorted out now. No more aliens should be abducting us because we told them not to. We sent a signal from the queen. We then killed the queen. So she's not going to be kind of starting the invasion anymore. Will Smith has been taken care of because he's just a willsicle now. And Kevin gets to go back to his loving family and continue the series. Mission accomplished. Oh, Kevin's very sad. Oh, Kevin, I know. I know you didn't want to have to do it, man. But there was no other option. What can I do to make you happy? Kevin, Kevin, come, come out. Oh, see, he takes it really hard, man. He didn't want to have to do it. Oh, what can I do to make you feel better? I know, Kevin, I know something that always makes you feel better. Do you want to fight Justin Bieber on the front lawn wearing a ninja costume? Yeah, let's fight Justin Bieber on the front lawn while wearing a ninja costume. That'll make you feel better. I love that this guy's just like, whoa, Justin Bieber and a ninja are fighting. Hi, guys. I'm going to do some push-ups. There you go, Kevin. Do you feel better at all? I'm sure you do. And he feels confident. It's just that easy. I know Kevin too well. You know what, Kevin? Let's just top that off with a nice bieber -sicle. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So worth it. That's going to be it for this episode of The Life of Kevin, guys, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this kind of silly story arc that I did. It was over the last three episodes. I wanted to do something a little different rather than go from episode to episode. It's, uh, I don't know, storytelling can be fun with The Sims. It's a little bit different. I have lots more ideas for these little kind of stories, but uh, I'm not sure when they'll come into play. So let me know if you guys enjoyed this, and maybe I'll do it again sometime. Thank you guys for much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. So you are a female, and you're a baby! Oh no, you're a juvenile. Look at him. Hello, Mr. Penguin. And are you the baby? You're the baby. Oh no, you're the juvenile again. They're so little. Oh my God.